What's up, guys? Welcome back to another Only Phrase podcast with yours truly, Fraley. Um, let's see here. I think I left off of talking about um, trip to New York City. Uh, still overwhelmed about how big a city like that is. Like being so, like being so small in such a big ass city with millions of people, it's just it's overwhelming. But um, I think also I was talking about uh, going to Boston. I was in the Boston area for a couple of days, more days than I really wanted to be, but got to see a little bit more than. But while I was in Boston, I I didn't tour the USS Constitution. Uh, it would have been cool to actually get on and see the see the old ship, the the whole tea heart, the Boston Tea Party thing, how it that part of it. Um, I went to. Got a couple of good pictures of the front of Cheers, where they filmed the beginning intro of Cheers. It's an old TV show. Uh, went in there and ate. Had got a mug from uh, from the place that I don't know. It's just kind of cool. But um, sorry, I'm I'm a little tired and kind of like a high hungover so yeah so speaking of which you can not state of New York is also legal in cannabis but um so is Massachusetts so got experimented with experienced that going to a dispensary that was pretty cool but um After cheers and all that, I, I pretty much uh, went back to the campsite and just camped out for the next couple of days. Weather was kind of eh, so I didn't really do much. Um, but that Sunday, I had a ticket to go see a ship. Okay, it was it was the USS Salem, and the reason why I wanted to tour an old Navy ship is because my granddaddy, Papa, was in the Navy, and that was one of the ships that he was on when he was in the Navy, so it was kind of sentimental and, like, kind of, you know, it it meant a lot to me to go see this ship and, like, walk where he walked, probably in some places, but, um, Oh yeah. This is the toll booths or whatever and they take your picture so I've been doing all kinds of random faces each time you go to the uh, toll booths. <laughs> Still got that humor. But um Yeah, the massive ship um it's got all kinds of if you ever if you're ever in the Boston area it's in Quincy which is a little bit south of of Boston it's in the Quincy uh, oh shit port in the harbor it's anchored down she, she's a beautiful ship very beautiful she needs she needs some work to get cleaned back up, but I don't think a whole lot of people would take tours and go look at ships. I, I did because I and mean, it was even funnier, like they were having some type of paranormal uh, weekend. So pe- different different groups were bringing in stuff and talking about how they were picking up heat signatures on the ship and like finding ghosts excuse me 
So I listened to some of them, and I, it was kind of cool. I, they actually spent the night on the ship and, like, was looking for ghosts, which was pretty cool. But after uh, I toured the ship, the USS Salem, I, uh... Oh yeah, that's right, yeah. I left there, and then I started headed to, uh... I went up... I'm back in New York now. I'm... So... The Adirondacks. I went and stayed up in the Adirondacks. The Adirondacks. So, I camped up there for a couple of nights. Um... Let's see. Uh... It was the Lake Placid White Face Mountain. Climbed White Face Mountain. Um, that was cool. Uh, gorgeous, like, scenery. Like, the seeing the lakes up there like that. That was absolutely cool. Um, camped up there for a couple of nights. Then I headed down to Syracuse. Um, nice, little, nice little city. You know, saw a lot. Saw hung around the lakes until uh buddy dave the guy uh early in the earlier episodes that did one on a truck driver dave the trucker but um met up with him had a few libations you know cool off you know for a long day of doing nothing <laughs> um let's see Spend time, yeah. Spend time with him. He, he, it was nice of him to let me crash on his couch. So I crashed on his couch. Thank you, Dave, for that. Um, let's see. Right now, I am headed to uh, Niagara Falls. So nobody, nobody really talks about Niagara Falls anymore. It's like. After it was like a huge like attraction, it just seems like nobody really talks about Niagara Falls anymore. It was supposed to be like one of the wonders of the world or something like that. Or it still, it's, I think it still is. I'm not sure. I I haven't thought about it. I just figured, you know, like New York area up here around close to Canada. Well, I will be able to see Canada for the first time. So it'd be cool. For that, get to see you know another country, you know, from yeah, yeah you, you get what I'm saying. Um, if this video is bouncy, I'm sorry, but so yeah, this that's the uh, update. But other than that, I just been oh, got me some new uh, hiking shoes, second pair. Um, I haven't gotten these though. These are North Face, and these mother—I don't know what it is—but they are comfortable, real, real comfortable. Like the way that the way to walk, it's like it's like curved, so you're like almost it feels like you're walking like on a very soft surface, but they're very, very, very nice. It's just. gotta break them in but um yeah heading to Niagara Falls now if if there's any place that anybody you know think of but I've been pretty pretty well hitting some like really cool little towns little cool little places like that like didn't even know it on the map or anything. Well, I mean, it's on the map, but, like, nobody really goes through it or anything like that. It's crazy to see all these old, um, these buildings, you know, that was here when, like, when, it was, when stuff was a huge attraction. Like, going up to a certain mountain or a ski lodge and nobody, nobody really goes up to those, like, Going to, like, it's kind of like the Niagara Falls. Nobody really talks about going to Niagara Falls. Like, oh yeah, we're going to Niagara Falls for summer vacation. Nobody, you don't hear that. 
like all the places like like if you're going down some old uh, country highway anywhere in the US you're gonna see all these old buildings from like towns that were you know prosperous because they didn't have the interstate system the highway system it was always the people had to come that way and now it's but I'm gonna try to integrate video and photos and stuff so when I do do a podcast so y'all can see some of the pictures but if you really want to see the pictures you can go follow my Instagram and the only for the only phrase Instagram I haven't been posting anything on that I need to get back to doing that it's been mainly on mine my personal account so if you want to take a peek of the photos there I need to upload some but why share why share all this beauty with the, what I'm seeing with y'all when y'all can get off y'all's asses and y'all can come do it yourself it's well worth it I, I'm loving every minute of it I feel happier I feel energized I feel relaxed I just grr. Uh, it looks like it's gonna rain I hope it holds off until I can get my tent set up but um Yep, Niagara Falls, here we come. But with that, please listen, watch, like, share, podcast. If you, if you enjoy enough of it, message me. Find a way to message me. Find a way to contact me. But other than that, y'all stay tuned.